Mary and I have come to Petworth House and uh, there's some beautiful rhododendrons out to sea and they're quite magnificent and we're just standing a little bit below that uh, particular folly. There have obviously been quite a lot of bluebells here though it looks as if we have missed most of them. Beautiful bluebells. Bluebells in the woods. Since Marion and I had last come to Petworth, they have sown lots of plants uh, to make lots of extra borders along this particular pathway near Petworth House. They're going to be magnificent in years to come. Petworth is ablaze with colour at the moment. The other side of that wrought iron fence it looks as if you can just uh, hop over to the grass on the other side but when you come to the other side you can see it's a lot more complicated to get back than it looks. The rather austere exterior of Petworth House but inside is the most amazing collection of paintings including dozens of Turner paintings that would match many of the finest art galleries in Europe and it's quite a large lake. And it's a bank holiday Monday in May and I'm wondering why there aren't any rowing boats here and there could be a little cafe selling teas and coffees with a veranda and an ice cream stall. There would be uh, great commercial opportunities and if they want more people to come that's what you'd expect. So I would have thought. And there in the distance is that somewhat austere building of Petworth. How interesting, here is a fire escape ladder. And when you see all the tall windows on Petworth House, no wonder they've got one. Would it be able to get round quickly enough, I wonder?